We are heading out to get a little bit of breakfast before we're meeting up with the rest of the family. So the place that we wanted to eat at is closed, mm. which I thought it was going to be. And Alex was like, no, there's no way. It's going to be closed. There's no way. It's they serve 30. coffee. So herein lies the dilemma in that we don't speak the language and we don't know where any other food places are. Look for a cafe and the first place we see we should just stop at. And he's all, there's no cafes. There's no place to eat. We found a cute little cafe. We saw this sign. It's a cafe vanilla with like a coffee cup. Yeah, but we kept, we kept passing it. We kept looking inside. It was a flower shop. So we finally walked in because we were like, there's no way that a flower shop would have a coffee as its logo. So we walked in and there was a coffee shop above it upstairs. I got a cappuccino and we also have muffins coming. We are officially off to catch the bus to go to this castle. That was a very delicious breakfast. We're here, we're actually the first people here. So we're just gonna chill out and wait for this bus to come. I'm super excited to see the castle. I love castles. Kind of miss our little plant, Harriet, already. Alex, do you miss Harriet? You miss what? Harriet, our plant. Oh yeah. A lot of people have been asking me why I haven't been posting videos on my beauty channel and my vlog channel. And I said yesterday, I feel like that deserves its own video. But the short answer is just that I felt like I needed to take a step away to just like figure out where my heart was with it. I've been doing videos at this point for close to a decade. And um, for many of those years, it was my full-time job. And I just started to feel a little stuck with it. I'm not sure if that's the right word, but I just, I don't know. I needed like some time to center myself. It's really hard to put into words like all my thoughts on it and I the reason I never really like did like a goodbye video is because I never intended to be gone. I've taken breaks before. I've taken probably up to six months off of videos like in my decade of doing videos so I never felt like oh I'm never doing YouTube again. And after the wedding and everything I just felt like I'm just going to take a little bit of time and settle into my new life as a newlywed and concentrate on my shop. And before I knew it, like eight months have gone by or something like that. And I did do Vlogmas, so I guess, well, yeah, that would be about seven months. So yeah, there's a lot more actually that I want to say on it and a lot more reasons um, that I've kind of been like trying to figure out how much I want to go into it. But I think a lot of it just has to do with when I started YouTube, I was like super, super private. And over time, it just kind of became more exposed, I guess, with everything. Like, for instance, before Alex and I got engaged, people didn't even know we were dating. I was super private about that. And I think the wedding being like just so open and everything, I just needed a break. I just needed to step back and concentrate on other things in my life. On the bus. We're on the bus. Yeah. They prune them or that's just how they grow. I don't know. I love old castles. Look at this massive door. Oh my goodness. This is a very medieval looking castle and I love it. It's like the most medieval one I've ever seen. We are taking a headphone tour of this castle and I love it so much. I wish you guys are here with me. Alex went ahead and he's doing more of the high steep stairs towers part of the tour. So we're sitting this one out. So we are sharing this dessert thing. It's like a fritter. I've never seen little fruits like that before. Have you? They're like grapes, but tiny. Goodbye to the castle. I've had three people from Poland snap me back and say that they know what the fruit is and they've said three different things. What so is, what fruit? is it gooseberry, currant, or something that starts with an L that I can't pronounce? But those are the three that I've been told that those little tiny fruits were. We loaded back on the bus. We drove about an hour, I think, maybe maybe longer. I don't know. It was a little longer. And I think. we're now in a town called Turon. Pernicus was born here, and there's a huge church over there, and we're gonna check it out. Oh, bye. Okay. LOL. Hashtag husbands. What? Yum. I'm so excited to dig into this. Look at that mound of spaghetti. We had our spaghetti dinner. Mm. We're heading back to the bus. Good morning. I totally fell asleep last night and did not finish my vlog. And today's already been a long day before I'm even starting this. We've been on a mission. We left the room in order to go back to that cafe to get a cappuccino. 
We ended up on a wild goose chase to get Alex some internet dongles. After you, husband. We got that figured out. So now I am just waiting for him to wrap up and we're gonna go get some breakfast. The plan for today is super relaxed and casual, which is nice because we've been like really, really busy the last two days. We're just going to kind of take it easy and explore a little bit. I'm going to show you guys this um, cafe that's on top of a flower shop that we could not figure out for the life of us. It's probably actually super obvious. We could not figure it out though. And then after you come up that flower shop, you are in a really, really super cute little cafe. So, got a cappuccino and a raspberry tart. We just talk about how gorgeous these little breakfast tarts look. I'm so excited. We're gonna share blueberry and raspberry. And we also each got a cappuccino. So this is our little breakfast and it looks really, really good. Good night, Wasi. Good night, Wasi. <laughs>